<laughs> What's this, Zanes? Reports of increasingly violent gang activities. Oh, shit! Oh, my God. I remember, uh, I remember Zara and Smash decks. Let's see. We need, uh, we need Blood Tear Alchemist. Lava Slasher. Probably is a keep just because what's interesting about this deck is that you can just play lava slasher as a tempo four seven remember when lava slasher was a four nine jesus christ what were they thinking remember when grandmaster variax was a seven drop oh yeah the uh the double ramp with uh into variax deck the thing about it was that, um, it was, like, really obnoxious in the, hmm. What do I need Plasma Storm in this matchup for? Um, this isn't really a minion. Obdurator is the one that repairs your artifacts. So I can't play the Blood Tier Alchemist because the Obdurator just repairs it. There's Crater, so if I can get into, uh, melee range, I can do Crater, Blood Tier, Punch to break my opponent's artifacts in one go. Plasma Storm? Yeah, Plasma Storm used to be 4 mana way back in the day. You know that often goes underappreciated? All the mana-based CCGs. Duelist's got to be the most balanced in terms of going first versus second. Of course, for ones like Legend of Runeterra, Artifact, Returns are shared. Oh yeah, that's true. They did a lot of work. Um, oh, we get to break their Artifact. I should have kept the um, Invigoration. Hmm. Do I keep Drogon here? It's actually kind of risky for me to stay close. I could keep Egg Morph in case my opponent has a Mara Healer. I'm going to replace Drogon. I need to look for healing. It was a misplay. It was a misplay for me to uh, replace the Invigoration. I should have kept the healing. Rust Crawler, which is a one of, I believe, in this deck, and it's it's meant to count help me counter the uh, to counter spell should die, like um, artifact should die. Artifact Song High specifically is um, a hard counter to Magmar, and it this deck is is teched against that with the Blood Tear Alchemist, the Crater, and the Rust Crawlers. The, the thing about this deck is it's designed to be really, really hard control, but artifact decks are one of the few matchups that make it so that um, you, you become the aggressor in the matchup. Don't need homeostatic rebuke. Dagona. Hmm. I could just I could just back away, play Mechanter War Beast. Like if I step away too, move the uh Blood Tear Alchemist down. Actually no, because the Mechanter would die to the Staff of Akir. Um So I could um just do Tempo Lava Slasher by stepping back one and then Hmm. I guess the question becomes, do I want to walk away? I could do this. I could walk straight up and then play two like this. You want to make your mechanters die due to Mirage? That's a good point. <coughs> oh, goodness. I forgot about the superior Mirage. All right, so there's actually <clears throat> there's actually um, a small decision to be made regarding whether you put the Rust Crawler or the Lava Slasher underneath your general. And putting the Lava Slasher underneath me plays around um, Wildfire Onk because I have a tankier minion that's still going to protect me here. You like uh, you like the Mechanter face better. The main issue is Spine Cleaver. 
Well, I mean, if they have Spine Cleaver, the, the issue is that I have three Invigoration and two Earth Sphere, I think, in this version of the deck. Oh, they conceded. You got Plasma, which counters it, so never mind. Plasma Storm does counter Spine Cleaver. It lets you kill your own totems. I shouldn't be going out like this playing this control magmar deck. <laughs> 